Hey guys, what's up? Wanted to bring you, you some news on Cydia version 1.1 and some cool tweaks I found. So we haven't made a video like this so uh, for a while, so I thought we'd do this. First off, I want to tell you guys that we have a Facebook page, and you can like us to get information delivered on Facebook. All you have to do is go to the link in the description, hit the like button, and that would be awesome if you did that. And now I'll move on to the video. So... Um, if you uh, have gone into City recently, it'll say that there's updates, and if you press the, OK, the accept button, wait for it to load, then City will uh, upgrade to version 1.1. If not, you can just wait till another jailbreak. It's not too great, but it's sort of interesting. So I'll show you that by booting up City right now. And this update makes it so it can basically multitask. It's a little different than actual multitasking. It's um, It looks nicer, it loads faster, and everything works a little better. So go to the main screen. Pretty much everything is the same. We can go to sections, looks the same. Changes, I've noticed, loads a little faster. As you can see, all the changes, and you can see how fast that loaded. And the repos look a lot smoother in the manage. And it also, it, it makes it so it's multitasking. So if you're in the sources page, you'll be there when you open up the app unless you take it out. of Multitasking. Then you have the search, and this is probably the biggest uh, look improvement or biggest change, more like. You can see we'll search display recorder, and it will show up right there. Tap on it or click it. And you can see that the computer is lagging a little bit compared to the device, but it like instantly notices it's purchased, and it instantly finds out if it's compatible or not. It's a lot faster. I'll show you the multitasking. Where I'll exit out of the app, scroll, and come back. And it takes a little while to load, but you see we're on SP settings right now and I'll show you what it looks like to install something. And now I wanted to show you two cool city apps that are um, found in Cydia. You can get the repos and the names in the description of this video. Anyways, I just wanted to showcase these two. These ones st uh, stood out to me in the last few weeks. First we have Spring Tomize, which is basically a whole ton of settings and I believe this and the other one are paid so if you uh, value it then buy it if not there's plenty of other tweaks so this one you have basically just a whole ton of settings it's like a lot of things compiled you can see you have settings for general you have settings for capabilities like um, special settings you have uh, capital you have sorry settings for your icons which is um, really extensive like you can do every little thing on them. You can see if you saw in the beginning of the video, I don't have any um, titles on my icons. I think it looks clear like that. You can do whatever you want. Um, there's folders, doc, just basically every setting you'd ever need compiled into this app. So it's pretty nice, uh, especially if you like messing around with this stuff. Now there's also one more thing, and it's called Swipe Nav, and this one is free actually. I take that back. And it's really nice because you can, it's really simple, it doesn't get in the way. All it does is you can swipe like this and it will go back, opposed to having to push settings to go back. Or the little, uh, this works on like um, this type of view um, that's implemented in the SDK. Like you'll see it in, it'll work in any app that has this. Like if you go into general settings, you'll be able to swipe back without pushing the settings. And it works in pretty much every app. So those you can get with the uh, information in the description. That's it for this video. Thanks for watching and remember to subscribe.